Hey guys, this is Ryan from Extreme Tech. Uh, so there are currently two voice recognition options that are well integrated with Android devices. There's S Voice on the Samsung Galaxy S3, which is what I have right here. And there is Google Now, which comes on the Nexus 7 and uh, currently some versions of the Galaxy Nexus, and that's that one right there. Uh, so I thought we would just take a quick look and see how these both respond to some of the same queries. Uh, so let's get started. What's the population of Beijing? The population of Beijing was 20.18 million in 2011. Twelve point four six million people. Okay, well they have um, very different answers. I guess uh, Google now pulled that from Wikipedia and it got it a lot faster than S Voices did, uh, but they both understood the question, so there's that at least. Let's try this. Set an alarm for 8 a.m. Setting alarm. All right, this is your alarm for 8 a.m. Should I save it? I won't save this alarm, then. Okay, so that uh, worked correctly and about uh, the same speed on both devices. Is it going to rain tomorrow? No, rain is not expected the tomorrow in St. Paul. The forecast for tomorrow, is, the forecast for tomorrow is 86 degrees and mostly sunny. Okay, so they were kind of talking over each other there, but um, you could probably hear that Google now actually answers the question first it tells me uh, that it's not going to rain and then it shows the forecast. Uh, S Voice also understood the question. Uh, it just pulled up the forecast though. Okay, let's try this. Open Chrome. No matching applications found. Please okay. try again. Well, so both, both of them failed on that one. Um, let's try that again. I know that one of them should do this. Open Chrome. Okay, there we go. So yeah, um, S Voice does open apps for you. Google Now does not. It just uh, it searches the web for Open Chrome and it pulls up the Open Chrome project, uh, obviously. So that's a difference between uh, between the two services. Turn on Bluetooth. Bluetooth on. Um, and this, this is interesting. Uh, I don't know if you can read this on the, uh, the Nexus 7, but it says, sorry, device features are not yet supported. Uh, so while the Galaxy S3 and S Voice uh, will let you toggle radios on and off, apparently Google now is going to do that eventually. Uh, for the time being, it doesn't do anything. It just searches the web for how to turn on Bluetooth. We're going to try something a little different. What does a wombat look like? And, uh... I'm sorry. I don't have the answer. <laughs> um, so like to search the web? Google now uh, pulls up a bunch of pictures of wombats, which are apparently kind of ugly. Uh, and uh, S-Voice is, un is, is unsure what that means it didn't even it didn't even understand the word wombat actually um, but it would offer to search the web and then you could click over to images but Google now does it in one step and overall thus far it looks like the voice recognition part of Google now is a little bit better um, let's try this when did John Wayne die John Wayne died on June 11 1979 Okay, so Google now got it. As voice is thinking. There we go. Monday, June 11th, 1979. Okay, so it took a minute, but they <laughs> they both got it. Um, the UI for Google now is actually pretty cool. Um, it pulls up a lot of a lot of good images with the results. 
Um, let's try one more. This is something you might, you might actually want to use your device to do. Find Thai restaurants nearby. Here's a list of places I found in Find Thai restaurants nearby. Okay, so they both uh, manage pretty much the same thing. Both have a, a list of, of Thai restaurants, and uh, these will link out to maps, except that's, um, this top result is not a, a Thai restaurant. Um, but more or less the same thing. But you'll notice again that Google Now was a lot faster. Um, the probable reason for that is that uh, Google Now is doing the voice to text transcription locally, and then it's just uploading a text string to do the actual search online. Um, S Voice, I think, is actually sending uh, a compressed voice uh, recording to the S Voice servers to be, uh, to be worked out. Um, so, I mean, both these apps have their strengths. Uh, S Voice, you can launch apps with. Um, it's a little bit um, faster to get to. You just double tap the home button. Um, Google Now, you have to you reach up and you tap the microphone at the uh, at the top of the screen. Um, and uh, Google Now is just a little bit faster, and I think it's more attractive. The user interface is better. Um, but then again, Google Now only on uh, the Nexus Seven and uh, the unlocked uh, Galaxy Nexus phones right now. S Voice, you can get on any carrier. So I guess that's. Uh, that's the uh, the main difference right now. But uh, that's all I got, guys. Thanks for watching.